All right, so I, I promise this video is not to make people above 40 or above above their early 40s. Sorry, my keys. I don't mean to make make people feel um, bad for trying to pull out pull for me to pull out the age card and talk about my aches and pains as I get older. But man, you know, it starts slowing down a little bit. But once I hit my 40s, um, I'm in my 40s right now, my early 40s. I'm getting pain in spots I never thought existed. Um, like, I've had this reoccurring neck issue, and I wasn't sure what it was originally. I had a hunch that it was from working out, but I couldn't quite pinpoint it. Then I thought it was the pillow. And drum roll, drum, drum a roll, please. What is the culprit? It's a little bit of both. I found out one of the pillows was a little bit too soft. I switched it, made a big difference. But as far as the working out, this is the first time it happened. I was doing my back and bicep workout, and this always happens during my back and bicep workout. Not always, but the times that it did happen, it happened a couple of months ago. I was doing my back and bicep workout in the garage, and I was either doing rows, seated rows, or doing shrugs. And, I, and as I did it, it wasn't like a sharp pain, but I just felt something back here. And that's the first time it happened right when I was working out. The other times it was more like gradual. Like I would work out, I'd feel good. And like half an hour later, I'd be like, oh, my neck feels funny. And I would tell my wife and say, yeah, my, my neck feels funny now. I just worked out, but I was fine during the workout. And, uh, excuse me. And now it just kind of crept up. It was like a delayed response. But yesterday was the first time that I actually felt it during the workout. So that leads me to believe that it's from the workout, so what exactly is it? I'm not 100% sure. I think I might be, like, when I'm doing seated rows, I might be jerking my cervical spine a little bit, maybe too much. Maybe the weight's too heavy slightly. I'm not a big heavy lifter, but I think my forms might have been, form has been a little bit off, possibly. Um, on the shrugs, I'm not sure. You know, I'm doing 65s, and I probably can go up, but I haven't bought the weights yet. I'm not sure if I am. And I'm going like this, and I don't know if I'm, like, stretching pulling my neck I may have to do like a form check and just film it on the side by myself for my own sake just to see what's going on so um it's just a little not a rant video but just a heads up on on uh, the aches and pains of uh, working out and also uh, this is a cautionary tale for myself and for others out there you know I mean I'm sure it's just the next brain I haven't had a chance to research it yet and it'll go away but if this is if this keeps happening over and over it's something that I should not ignore. I need to fix it, find out what the root of the problem is, and then and or just avoid the exercise altogether or find an alternative way. So I'll keep you guys and gals updated on that because injuries, uh, I luckily haven't, haven't had anything, like no broken arms and stuff. Just 2014 was the my worst, probably my worst year. I for my very old school subscribers, I, I didn't do leg workout for, I missed about six months of leg workouts due to a fracture and a, a tear. I hated it on my left leg, left and right leg. But other than that, I've had some minor ailments, pectoral strains. I was out a few weeks, so it's going to happen. I'm very smart about it, but no one is uh, immortal and uh, we all get older. Daddy time um, catches up to everyone. I am a dad. Uh, and um, it's something that you don't want to work through the pain. Um, I've been guilty of it slightly once in a while. I'll be like, oh, I'll just do one more set. That is something you don't want to do because it's one of those things where if you if you snap it up, as the Hodge twins say, if you snap shit up, uh, it could be life altering. Uh, not to scare you, not to not to fear monger, but it is what it is so it's good to be healthy it's good to exercise um, be very active but like most things if you go overboard you don't listen to your body things can happen so anyway let me know from you guys and get from you guys and gals the ones that are a little bit older or a little bit older than me did you experience the same type of symptoms once you hit your 40s because yeah i never had problems with my neck when i worked out ever when i did back and bicep ever never and now it's like kind of crept up uh, once every couple months. So that's my time. Thanks for watching. Stay safe, everyone. I'll talk to you next video. Bye.